is going on, everybody? My name is Ethan. Welcome back to Hard Cap Games. Another episode here on the channel today. I forgot what I was doing, and I ran off into the patch of grass over on this route. And our first encounter was a barrel, so it's technically species. However, um, we don't actually have it. We had a bee doof. We never got a barrel. So this is our encounter for this route. Uh, I wasn't quite ready to start this episode, but it is what it is, you know. We need to absorb. It's gonna do like six damage. <laughs> Um, I was I was gonna come over here and train Forgetting that I said that I was gonna wait to get an encounter until I have my good rod, but It is what it is. So I'll just come over here I'm gonna switch into Lantra. This is our encounter for this route um, So it is a bib barrel Drop my attack, that's fine. I'll swift. Ouch. Oh lord! That hurt. Come back, Weasel. That gave me a panic attack for a second. Oh lord, don't do this. I'm just gonna knock off. You can only do this twice. If it does it any more, we're in trouble. All right. Gotta throw a Pokeball at him. Need him to stay in it. Two. That's really bad. Um, I'm gonna throw one more ball. If he breaks out, we're not getting the barrel. Oh lord, this is gonna be tough. Yep, we're out. We're done. Nope. Nope. We're gonna fail that encounter. Okay. So I was getting ready to, gr uh, to grind up the team. It's been about 45 seconds the last one was recorded, which I believe today should now be. It should be Tuesday now. So this should be the last day of three day uploads. This should be episode 13 then. If I, if I counted correctly, did I count correctly? Let's check. 10, 11, 12. Oh no. Yeah, this should be episode 13. Welcome to Tuesday, everybody. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day, regardless of where you are in the world. Um, now that our team isn't dying, we can do a quick team recap if we need to. Um, just to remind you guys what we got going on. Uh, we got Bruce, we got Macho, Houdini, Lantra, and Cleef, And we've got this egg right here, which I believe is a Hapini. Uh, I could be wrong on that. Um, I also talked to a dude and he gave me the odd keystone, which is going to be very useful in a little bit. Um, but for now, we're gonna come over here and talk to Fantina. She's gonna make us go do a contest, probably. Excuse me, are you entering the Super Contest Show? Oh, please enjoy yourself. Fantina, the Heartworm City Gym Leader, also happens to be a Super Contest Show expert. How else? Well, I am Fantina. You may challenge me, but not yet. You must become stronger, then you may challenge me. So I'm gonna have to come back and challenge her later. I guess I should go in. Yep, my hero. Oh, hi, Ian. Whoa, it's mom! Joanne is your mom? She might be a super contest show star. I don't know about that. Never spoken to you about super contest shows. I'm surprised you don't know each other, though. That's right, and to thank you for earlier, please take this sticker. One ethereal sticker C. Please place it on one of your ball capsules. I'm just a show judge. If you're unsure, we also offer practice sessions. See you later. Were you surprised to see me, Ethan? I was. Got a little bored, so I came up to Heart Home for a little vacation. Just surprised to see you here, my dear. Are you serious about entering the Super Contest show? Not dressed that way. It's your Pokemon's time to shine, so you shouldn't be just your usual way. Put this on for a little glamour. Tuxedo. Um, where does it tell me what type of moves each one is? Thanks. Hmm. Go what? 
Is that an online contest? They'll put up a photo if your Pokemon is selected. Seems like there's just a lot of contests here. A lot of people here telling tell me a lot of nothing. The more notes you hit in time, the better your score will be. What does that mean? Get yeah, one shot. According to other performers, use a contest move when you feel the time is right. I would like to go up. I have no idea what's happening here, but this music, absolute bop. Hey, she's got a crowbat. I want a crowbat. Oh well. All right, maybe they'll let me go now. Oh, we gotta fight Barry. Oh, no, I don't want to do this. No, Barry, stop. I don't have any way of beating his, his Primplup. Or his Starly. I need an electric type. Badly. I've lost my two rock types and my electric type. So. <sighs> That's so cool, Barry. You're such a cool dude. Wow. Watch him use it again. I hate this so much. This is so obnoxious, Barry. You're, you're endeavoring double team jerk of a Starly. Thank you. Okay, there's one. Bruce leveled up. I don't even know who I send in. I'll just send in Houdini and just use Confusion and hope that nothing happens. Like, like that's the best that I can do at this point in the series, is pray nothing happens. Confusion. Just half. It's okay. It's okay, we eat that. It's okay, we're still faster. That's fine. Knockout. Good. Okay. This isn't nerve wracking at all. Roselia, so go back in here. I need to learn Air Cutter. I'm just saying, Bruce, you need to learn Air Cutter or Air Slash or whatever you're gonna learn. You have to learn it. Yeah, I figured you were gonna do that. God, I hate Barry. He's gonna leech seed me too. What a jerk. Cool, it's three. How many does he have? I think Weasel might be able to evolve. I 
All right. Uh, the, the smart thing in terms of type matchups is to go into Lantra. However, I don't trust that Weasel can eat whatever Ponyta throws at him. I'm really considering, once I have the ability to actually like legitimately grind in this game, on like decent Pokemon, I'll probably swap Weasel out for something else. Um, if somewhere along the way we somehow lose, um, what's his name? I should use Revenge. I knew he was faster than me. Um, if we if we lose Bruce along the way, it's going to be for um, Leviathan. If we don't then it'll be for Shellos. Um, I don't even remember what I named the Shellos. All right, we beat Barry. All right, Failstone is the next gem, which is a fighting type gem. So there's two ways that goes. Either we have a, um, a flying move and we have our psychic type, or we don't. <laughs> I would prefer we do, but we have a long way to go between here and there. <sighs> so. We can go to the next route. We have to get encounter here. Yep, they'll let us go now. We've also got the odd keystone. So. This is Route 209. I am currently leading with Bruce. We'll see what happens. Jar of honey. Nice. Oh, I haven't even done my honey tree encounter yet. Redemption. Redemption. Okay. So the Intimidate is nulled. I don't want to use... Um... That uh, fighting move. Or... I don't want to use Poison Fang. If I poison him, he's gone. I'm going to go into Launcher and I'm going to... Let me bite. Let's see what happens. See, he's gonna keep doing this until he can kill me. If he goes for a wing attack right now, that's huge brain. Don't do this, dude. So... This shouldn't do too much. He's gonna knock, he's gonna knock me down to 38. I just gotta pray. No, no, no! Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Plus.
Now, that is technically Species Clause. But, so far, we haven't enacted Species Clause if the Pokemon is still in our box. If it is dead, Species Clause does not come into play. Instead of Sterling, we have Sterlia. See her summary, she's got Intimidate. She's Bold Nature, which is not good. Oh, now we have all this stuff. It tells us again what we're doing. Sent to a box. Okay. Man, we could have gotten the barrel again. <laughs> that would have been not fun. Sterlia has joined the party. Oh, why'd you turn? Why'd you do that? I'm not healed. Why would you do that, Albert? If this dude has a rock move, I'm in trouble. Because I need to super potion Macho. If he's going to keep going for Mimic, then I'll just heal up my whole team on this fool. Don't do that. That's rude. Stop. All the NPCs in this game are just rude with dumb IVs and EVs and movesets. Good job, Cleef. I'm just gonna confusion whatever his next two Pokemon are to knock him out so I can go back and heal. That's all I want to do. There's another one. Houdini is level 26, by the way. I feel like that's a really high level. That's because it is. But. He's like the only reason we're getting through this game. Him and Macho right now are carrying us. Gen who cares about Gen 4? Gen 1 is what's really doing it for us. He's already evolving? What? Oh, look at him. But Bruce won't evolve. I haven't even done anything to this dude, and he's already a Clefairy. Cool. All right. Want to want to learn some moves? But why isn't Bruce evolved yet? Did I catch him in like a heal ball or something? That, oh, I did. I caught I caught him in a heal ball. Oh, that's why he he started off higher. That's nice. All right, okay. There is some light in this team. There's a little spark, you know? 
It's... How much of our team is Gen 1? One, two, three, four, four of the five. Four of the five is Gen 1. Might as well go play Fire Red. Or let's go. Okay. Um, I think we should go get the good rod. I wonder how close that egg is to hatching. I believe it's a peeny. If I'm remembering Diamond and Pearl correctly. Nowhere close. Okay. Let me save. Uh, let me look up, actually. Where do I get a Moonstone in this game? Moonstone in PDSP. So once I have Surf, I can get one in Eterna City. Or in the Grand Underground, or on Wild Clefairies, Cleffas, or Lunatones. Okay. Well, I don't want to do ball capsules. That just makes me sad. Um, so at some point, I will find my way all the way back to Jubilife to go get the mystery gift. At some point, I'll probably do it later. A good rod is really good. I agree. I do agree. Nope. I just said no. Don't keep talking if I say no. There we go. <laughs> My dude up there doing the moonwalk. Hold up. Running in place. Poison Fang you, and Low Sweep you, and I win, right? That's how this works? Mm-hmm. One. Two. Lovely. Great job, guys. You're doing great. Maybe Bruce is gonna evolve now. Fidal throw? Does not isn't the one that always goes last? Always goes last but never misses. I think I'd rather have the other two. I see I should have taught him that over focus energy. Oh well. I don't care about that. I think in this episode I'm gonna try to get to Silesion. There's a broken crumbling tower seem yep. Sure. It's been restored. The hollow tower. I don't know how to activate it though. Is it the same as before? Let me throw. Oh, she spotted me. All right. Well, then we'll battle these people. We'll get to Slacy on town and we'll call it there. 
Meditate and Machop. Hey, Bruce, I don't know why you don't like me, buddy, but if we put aside our differences and, uh, and get the heck out of here. Oh, that's the Machop I just used it on. Oh, that's really bad, actually. I just doubled into the Machop. The two things that are weakening a Psychic. Okay, I'm switching out. Um, I what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna switch out Bruce, go into Houdini, and I'm going to knock off the Metatite. Cause that should that should probably kill even. I'm level 24 now. Eat it. Eat it. What a good swap. Did you see that? Did you see that swap? Hope you did. That was like the biggest brain play I've done. Hmm. Guts. 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 Get rid of you. And I'll swap into Clefairy because Clefairy can actually be used because Clefairy is a tank. Even though he's a little under leveled at 18. Just get rid of you. Yep. All I need to do is get rid of you. Force Palm. Not very effective. Paralysis is annoying, though. Synchronize him. <laughs> oh, that's nice. I like that. He's paralyzed, and I disarming voice, and I confusion. End of battle. Ethan's a superior Pokemon trainer. So I'm very curious, actually. Are the unknown in this game? I don't know, because they already they took out hidden power. They got rid of it as a move. They're like, nah, I don't feel like it anymore. So like, like what the heck do we do? Like, what, what to the un what's the unknown's gimmick now? That now that they don't know hidden power anymore. I would like to teach rest of my Pokemon. It'd be great. All right. Well, this seems like a great spot to wrap up this episode right here. In the next one, we're actually going to go backwards to the tower, and we're going to do that. So, if you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you are new, and drop a comment. Who's your favorite member of the team now that everybody's gone? And what should I do to change up the team? So, that being said, my name is Ethan. It's been Hardcap Games, and I will see you in the next episode. Peace.